Can I show you? Good to see you. How pleased were you with the win against Forest last weekend? Yeah, it was good. Uh, a good win, obviously, um, on the back of a good win away at Fulham. Um, it was important to get the home form back, back to where it was before. Um, yeah, delighted, obviously. Yeah, it was a good win, yeah. It completed a really good month for us, didn't it, with three wins out of four in the league. Do you feel the team's in a really good place at the moment? Yeah, the team's good, yeah. I feel like everyone's feeling confident. Um, I think, yeah, when you get wins, obviously, you gain more confidence as well. Um, and obviously, we've, we've had a few injuries as well and, and managed to sort of, I think, last week against Fulham, or well, the week before, was sort of the back four hadn't played together before. Obviously, Clem came on on the right side, came into the right side, done a really good job, yeah. So, I think the team's showing that we're, we're willing to sort of play anywhere, really, and, um, and do our best to, to pick up points. Just something you've touched on there. How pleased are you with how the defence has coped with the injuries we've had and players coming into the back four and, and shuffling around quite a bit? Yeah, yeah, I think we've coped really well. I think, yeah, obviously everyone wants to play as well. Um, and when you have a, a few injuries, you, it's natural to obviously fill the spots in, 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 in different areas. And obviously we're short of numbers at the back as well. Um, obviously with Ez and, and Diego that were out, obviously. Um, but yeah, we obviously picked up some wins as well. Um, and now obviously there's a few more games coming up with Europe as well. Um, so yeah, obviously it's nice to have them back and Pau as well, obviously to come back. How important is it to keep building that momentum as we head into such an important stage of the season as well? Yeah, obviously we're in March, I think a couple more months to go. Um, and obviously, yeah, we've, we've made it clear in, in the group that you have to pick up results now and, and, and now sort of the crunch time, the last few months, obviously are the, the deciding few months. But I think for us personally, we're not putting too much pressure on ourselves. I think if we can just pick up points and slowly, gradually build up the league and, and, and stay in them areas in the top four, um, is really important and obviously with Europe as well we've got a great chance to obviously go to Ajax a new new different opportunity a different sort of um, experience for, for me personally and for a lot of players in the group and yeah we're looking forward to it. At the other end of the pitch to yourself Ollie's been nominated for the Premier League Player of the Month again he seems to be full of confidence right now doesn't he? Yeah, he's obviously flying. Yeah, he's obviously scoring goals. I remember last year or the year before. I think that no, I think it was last season. Um, I think his turning point was Southampton away, uh, where he, he had a little bit of a doubt before that, and and then he he scored away at Southampton, and then ever since that moment, he's been yeah he's been on fire. So credit to him. Like as a forward, it's difficult as well. Like if you're not scoring goals, and you feel a little bit less confident, it's obviously hard to get back into a routine because you can't just buy confidence for any player. Obviously, you can't just go to the market and buy, buy some coins and buy some confidence. So you have to perform to get confidence. Um, and yeah, he's done that in abundance, yeah. And just looking at the team as a whole, we've got the fifth best away record in the league so far. What do you think is the reasons behind that? We're obviously good at Villa Park, but being so strong away from home in particular. Yeah, I think we've obviously um, progressed at Villa Park. Obviously, we went on a, a, a massive run. And yeah, this year we've been, we've been resilient. I think the boys have been great. Um, yeah, obviously the atmosphere is good, um, but yeah, the boys on the pitch have been doing really well, so it's great. We head to Kenilworth Road this weekend. We've done our research. We think you've played there twice before twice, with yeah, former yeah. clubs. What do you make of it? What's it like to play at? Played there in League Two as well, actually. So Dagenham, yeah, that was twice. Yeah, I think yeah. two or three times. I think twice. Yeah, yeah. It's obviously a tough, tough ground. I think they make it difficult for teams to go there. But yeah, I think we've we've done a lot of a lot of research and, and we're ready for it. Yeah. And just finally, what kind of game are you expecting against Luton on Saturday? Yeah, no, so obviously a tough game, yeah, tough fixture. Um, hostile ground, they'll make it difficult for us. I've played there a few times, so the pitch is tight. I know what it's going to be like. Um, watched a few of the last few games. So, now nah, looking forward to it. Another test, obviously, to get to to get three more points on the board, if that's the target. Um, and we'll be looking forward to trying to do that.